The ever did respond at the Queen Renee IG live rant. Supposedly, Queen claimed she had recordings and receipts on Diera. I have screenshots. Um, I have so much evidence of people watching me, but y'all want to say it's me? Y'all make sense like, oh, we stalking or, you know? I'll tell you, play that voice memo. Don't play I it. Play, but I ain't going to do play. it. We got the real. Right. We got, don't play it, dude. Don't play it. Don't play right. It. Don't play it. You know what I'm saying? But we're just trying to enjoy our engagement. And it's like every time we do something, somebody just gets jealous and comes out, it seems like at this point. Dear post, I don't mind being talked about, but don't lie. Beefing with who? Not you. I don't give a Nobody can make me mad enough to go live. And she also liked the comment on Twitter that says, confuse them with silence. Holly Bentley responded at the girl post. This girl seems to have made a video where she said, when I go to a wide odds competition, but I see that my opponent is Haley. This is how wide her eyes. <laughs> Haley commented, you'd win. <laughs> Petty, son. So then Shorty replied with, no way you commented. Love you. And then uh, uh, some other girl commented, for real, I love when celebs just go out there busy days to make someone's day for real. It's so sweet. I don't think that's what was happening. <laughs> for reference, this is how wide Haley's eyes are. Okay, Pete. And this is how wide the girl's eyes are. Who's winning that competition? <laughs> this is a tough one. This is a tough one. This was a harder pick than Iowa versus South Carolina for that women's national championship game. I don't know. Comment who y'all think going to win that competition, man. Hit that follow button. Go subscribe to the YouTube and the bio game. I previously reported that Jessica and Reed broke up and a lot of people assume it had something to do with Reed ex Leilani. Well, Leilani did respond. She said, been in an amazing relationship mainly offline for over one year. Now, can you guys please stop with all these random assumptions? You never know what goes on in people's lives. Also, Jessica just arrived home after driving 39 hours from California. So I'm glad to see that she made it safe back home. Reed post as well since releasing a statement. He says somewhere on an island. See Jess, I told you to take that money. Now he done took the money and went on vacation. CJ so who claimed that royalty got hands put on her and people are asking me am i okay or did i have anything to do with it no but i did just pick my daughter from school in a lamb truck and uh yeah we're gonna go to the grocery store because today is the day i get the kids so if indeed their mom did get beat up or punched or whatever <laughs> hey that's not funny uh hopefully the kids are okay and they weren't involved or around to see that because that's just not how we live we're not trying to live like that no more so uh hopefully she can get it together because even though she thinks that I'm her biggest enemy. I, don't, I wouldn't wish her getting beat on because we too grown, man. If we're not getting paid to box, there's no need of letting your face be a punching bag. Rosie responded, what are you going to do when you run out of lies? Eight to zero. I'm not exactly sure how CJ got this information, but definitely stay tuned because I think it's more to this story. But let's talk about CJ So Cool mom because she started spilling a lot of tea after CJ So Cool comment. I guess my biological mom is now mad at me because her clout chasing tactics had pushed me further away from her. Or is it because I stopped giving her money for missing all those years of my life? I swear some black families are cursed because my story is super sad. Not one time did I ask him for one red cent. Not one time did I ever. He knows that. I never asked him for a dime. Treat, like I said, treat my mama like shit. He treats my mama like shit. You put on a show and take her on a little measly shopping spree and buy her a little car and then it's all good. Get her a phone and then you stop paying the phone bill. Come on, man. You crazy as hell. I would never do my mama like that if I had the money he got. And she raised me. And she raised me? Why would you do that to her? So if you're doing that to her and she raised you, then that lets me know that it didn't matter that I wasn't there for you because you would have been still treating me the same damn way because you treat my mama the same damn way. <laughs> I'm freaking believable. I mean, I'm, I'm, I should have never said I wasn't going to speak no more on him because, like I said, there was still more in me that I needed to get out. And people say, just call him on the phone. He won't answer his phone. He won't answer texts, DMs, or nothing. Every blue moon, it used to be. Every blue moon. You know, he reached out to me to come to Kamari's 11th birthday party, by, mind you. I didn't ask him about that. He asked me. I still got the text messages. Whenever he decided to talk to me, text me or whatever, I still got every last phone call, every last DM or text message. It's on his terms when he want to speak to me 
on his terms and his terms only. Now, when he was recovering, he promised the family that he wasn't going to be doing that no more, acting like that anymore. And I'd be damned if he didn't turn around and treat us back the same way he was doing us before he got shot. Man, don't nobody want your freaking money. Like I said, you gave that to me. Hell, I'm not going to turn it down, but I didn't ask you for it. Y'all, excuse me, but this is the only way that I can get, reach him is through this damn internet. Like I said, he do not answer phone calls or nothing. And I'm not finna be calling every time, Harry. Hey, can you relay this message to him? No, I'm not. You holding my pass over my head? I'm tired of that. I'm tired of you getting on the internet, doing how you do me. When you feel like you feel like speaking on me. You you made me feel like shit when I was there at the twins' birthday party. You lit, You really did. You really did. And you know you did. Yeah, it was all in the videos. You don't even know how to pull up a balloon. What kind of grandma is you? You don't even know how to put a bike together. I don't put shit together my own self at home. Carlos do it, or I pay somebody to, to put things together for me. That's the type of mom I am. I'm not like some of the other moms that, that put things together. I get frustrated easily. I pay people to put things together for me, do things for me. If I got the money, hey, can you put this together for me? Can you do this for me? That's the type of person I am. I've always been like that. Oh, so maybe he'll get this uh, message. Uh, I don't care if he do or don't. I don't care. I just wanted you guys to know my part. My part, how I feel about it. I'm still very hurt behind him making that video saying what he said. Uh, I'm still very hurt behind the twins, uh, being at the twins, for being there for the twins' birthday party and him saying the things that he said to me.